Hey guys, it's me Chris here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how I make my video thumbnails. So without any further ado guys, let's go ahead and set straight in. So the first step is to go ahead and open up your browser, so we'll just go ahead and open up Google Chrome here. And we'll just pop into the search engine background up three. I'll link this in the description below, guys, for you to go ahead and check out. So you want to go ahead and just click on the uh, link right at the top here. It should be panzoid.com. And this is basically the platform that you use to go ahead and create or edit your um, video thumbnails. So the first thing that I would do is go to basics and change this to video thumbnail or YouTube thumbnail. As you guys can see, they also do like Twitter. Um, profile pictures and also like YouTube one channel art as well so we'll just go with YouTube thumbnail for today and we'll change the background color to white I always do that so yeah you can also put in like layers so different layers of images and then you can move them around and uh, just like the opacity and things like that you guys can see here there we have also got overlays so if that's something you're interested in you can also do that but where you add most of your content text and images is here and we can, if we just click on add text, we'll just call this test video. And if we make that clear so we can see it in a different color, there we go. So as you guys can see here now, we can go ahead and move around that text and just place it where we want to. And um, we can do so much, you really can with this um, video um, thumbnail creator even. Um, so you can go ahead and adjust things like the text shadow. This is something I do quite often actually and if we go ahead and adjust like uh, the shadow color we can then give the text some depth which is really cool and it can really give like a really nice look um, to your text and can really portray the kind of look you're going for with your video so yeah guys that's the platform that I use uh, to make my video thumbnails and there's not too much to it if it comes to like effects and things like that I generally do that in um, Adobe Photoshop beforehand and then import it um, into this software very easily by just adding a image like so but yeah guys once you've done you click on download your background click download and it'll download to your computer so that's pretty much it if you guys did enjoy this video make sure you give it a big thumbs up and if you're around here make sure you subscribe if you have any questions make sure to drop them in a comment below and i'll see all of you in the next one